yesterday the day before. This is a really, really comfortable day. And this evening, got a chance to get outside. It's a Ranby factor of nine. Spectacular weather this evening. Hopefully you will find a way to get outside for an hour or two this evening. So far today, 78 and 61. Temperatures that are just a bit below average. No precipitation today. It's a beauty. Not quite one of the top 10 days of the year. Just too breezy at times. Radar is quiet around the Omaha Metro. There is this rain to the west of us. That's not going to make it into the Omaha Metro. Look at that view from 72nd and Crown Point. Skies are currently partly cloudy. We've got temperatures in the upper 70s. The northwest breeze at 10 and the dew point has dropped now to 59. Feels so comfortable because of that drier air. Low to mid 70s western Iowa, mid to upper 70s eastern Nebraska, 80 Lincoln. Beatrice and Falls City, and there are those dew points in the upper 50s. That is just outstanding. Here's a little bit of a northwest breeze. I mean, it's not much, but earlier today, winds were gusting 20, 22 miles an hour at Omaha's Epley Airfield, and that's a no-no for it to be considered one of the top 10 days of the year. Plenty of sunshine, some clouds over western Iowa. Cumulus clouds were thicker there, and now the tops of thunderstorms in central Nebraska blowing across eastern Nebraska and into western Iowa. It's actually a severe thunderstorm watch out here in northeast Colorado. You can see these thunderstorms dropping southward in uh, western Nebraska, Lexington, North Platte, dropping into Kansas this evening. But then more storms will develop here to the west. That's where the Storm Prediction Center says there's a risk, a slight risk, of severe weather this evening and tonight. Far western Nebraska tomorrow, the risk spreads out across South Dakota, Nebraska, and Kansas, but mainly west of the Omaha area and then Friday looks like a front drop southward with the main risk of any scattered severe storms south of us, though we'll be dealing with some shower and thunderstorm chances. Here's the evening. It looks fantastic. Sky's partly cloudy, uh, high pressure, air's dry, wind's pretty light. Tomorrow morning, more clouds around, spotty showers in advance of warmer air trying to push across the state, and you can see the scattered showers we deal with off and on. Storms will develop tomorrow late day across South Dakota. Those will tend to track southward along this warm front, but again, impossibility of some rumbles of thunder tomorrow night in Omaha. This night looks wonderful. Clear to partly cloudy, comfortable 61 degrees for the low. Tomorrow morning, not bad, partly cloudy, 7 a.m., 63, but spotty showers mid to late morning into the afternoon that probably keeps temperatures in the upper 70s for a high tomorrow. With the additional cloud cover over what we saw today. A little more sun, a little warmer and more humid on Friday, Saturday, 88. Now the rain chances are most likely Thursday night, Friday night and Saturday night. The days being drier and then you see the warming trend there as we get back up in the low 90s as we head into early next week. So summer's not over. It just felt like it today. Not